Hi there, Jamie Good of WineAirAct.com here. Um, and I'm going to be tasting six wines. It's six, so I'm going to taste them rather quickly. Um, all under the same brand. It's called Piggy Bank. And this is a series of six wines um, in two pairs. Two from south of France, two from Spain, and two from the Elki Valley in Chile, made by consultant winemakers. And it's this brand, Piggy Bank, is designed to be a charity brand. So for each bottle, um, you see on the back there's a QR code. You scan that with your mobile phone, you go straight to their website, and then you get to choose where you want the donation of 50 pence per bottle to go to. So the idea is you buy wine, um, some money goes to charity. Nice concept, but what are the wines like? Start off with the Sauvignon Blanc from the Elki Valley in Chile. Elki Valley right up in the north of Chile, um, very interesting wine region. Um, this is made by Giorgio Flessati, who's um, a vino, vino Mayu. Now this is um, really zippy, fresh, highly aromatic, lots of green methoxyparazine character, but it's in balance. Some nice tropical fruit there, a bit of passion fruit. On the palate, nice greenness, um, lovely intensity. It's a very powerful, exotic wine. Really emphasizing those green characters in Sauvignon Blanc. That's really good. For $7.99, these, all these wines are £7.99 each. I think that's, that's fabulous value for money. Really good wine, good concept. Let's move on to Verdeco from Spain, 2011 vintage. This is made by Norrell Robertson, again £7.99. And all of these are stocked by um, Waitrose. Um, I think one of them is going to be stocked by Tesco um, Wine Direct, but um, the rest are all stocked by um, Waitrose. Hmm, this is interesting. Crisp, clean and pure. It's got a nice citrus pith bite to it, a bit of a savoury bite to it. Very nice fruit, very nice acidity, very linear, um, very good quality. Um, but certainly, again, for £7.99, that's, that's, that's super. Wine 3, the Grenache Syrah Rosé. This is from the south of France, from Thierry Boudinot. That's quite sweet, not too sweet. It's a little bit of sweetness, a richness of texture. It's got some creamy, um, strawberry and cream, lactic, buttery notes there as well. Soft and approachable, easy to drink. Not quite in the same league as the first two, but not a bad wine. Let's move on to the reds. Start with the Tempranillo from Spain, Extra Madura. And this is Norrell Robertson again. Lovely aromatics, very pure, vibrant floral fruit. Raspberry jam, cherries, really exotic. It's a nice bit of grip there, some structure. It's um, clean, pure, unoaked style. Nice savoury bite there to the lovely pure fruit. That's a cracking wine, that's really good. 7.99, that's a good buy. Next red. Moving to a Grenache, Pays Doc from Languedoc, Thierry Boudinot. It's lovely, lovely, sweet pure, slightly peppery fruit in the nose. Mm, I really like this. This has got a lovely peppery um, freshness to it. It's got some structure. A 
lovely berry fruits, essence of Grenache there. Quite delicious. Another wine that over delivers for 7 99 so that's very good. Finally, we're going back to the Elki Valley where we started, and Giorgio Flassati and Syrah. Whoa, this is amazing. This has got a, an incredible clove, pepper, mint, fresh meaty red berry nose. It's really quite violety, floral. It's the floral side of Syrah, but there's also some savoury, meaty notes there as well. And some peppery bite on the palate, that's really attractive, but also with very rich, sweet, lush fruit. It's, it's got a richness that you'd associate with Chilean wine, but it's also got a freshness and a florality that you'd associate with um, cool climate syrup. That's very good indeed, that's a really good wine. Um, it's quite distinctive, it's, it's boldly flavoured, but I think it's really good. So, my verdict is um, Syrah, yeah, that's definite buy. Grenache, definite buy as well. Tempranillo, yeah, definite buy. The Verdejo, yeah, that's a good buy, like that. Um, Sauvignon Blanc, very good indeed. Um, Grenache, Syrah, maybe not for me, not my thing. But for those other five wines, they really over deliver for 7 .99. So, um, you know, you may think it's slightly gimmicky having this um, QR code and the donation aspect of the wines, but the wines really do deliver. And that's a nice side to it as well, having this charity link. So, um, overall, I'm really impressed. Good work.